Hi everyone, in this little tutorial I'm going to show you how to use the following two tools. That's the steady stroke and the predictive stroke tool. All right, for this I'm just going to make sure that I've got a standard paintbrush so I can show you how to do this. All right, so for the steady stroke, you'll notice that I can draw a line and you'll see here that it's at zero. So if I change this and I start to draw a line, you'll see that my line now has like a little dotted line um, trailing behind where I'm drawing my line. You can see that my line is much more smoother. Okay, so what this option is doing is it's, it's telling the computer to basically make my line a little bit smoother than just my normal drawing hand can do. The higher I put that number on the steady, you'll notice that the longer the line is that's trailing behind, which means you get a much smoother transition. Very good for long lines. Um, so if you're trying to do a large drawing and do a large outline, this is really handy. So you can get a nice, clean, smooth, consistent line. Okay. So that's the steady stroke. So for the predictive stroke, it means that I can do a drawing. And as soon as I let go, the computer is then smoothing those lines out for me. Really good if you're not that great at doing circles or you don't have a very steady hand. It will then just make your lines nice and smooth so that's not so bumpy and rumpy. Okay, so that's on the one. So the higher I press this button here, the more predictive it'll get. So you, you can see that as soon as I go up to our highest number, which is only five, I can do a semi good circle, um, but it will basically try and smooth that out really, really nicely. So the more it's going to um, smooth your shape or your drawing that you're drawing. I hope that makes sense, guys. So basically one to five, the higher your number, the smoother it's gonna create your lines for you. All right, guys, play around with those and see how, um, how good your lines are in your drawings.